G'day YouTube, 1MJ here. Well, as the title says, optimis, optimism, <laughs> sorry, optimism is growing, but should I beware? Well, optimism is definitely growing, and again, it's all it's all through, you know, all the different vlogs and things like that. But there should be a an element of let's say caution. Caution would be the best word. We can see here that Bitcoin options they show that most people are betting on a 50k price in 2021. Now, I personally believe uh, Bitcoin will do 50,000 quite easily in 2021. Uh, exactly how high it'll go. Who knows, that's hard to say, but really, uh, to go up sort of 5x in the next, you know, well, I suppose, uh, they're saying somewhere between June and December, so I guess that's the next sort of year to a year and a half. Yeah, 5x would be all right, I wouldn't be complaining, but yeah, my, my gut feeling is I think we're going to see a much higher price than Bitcoin uh, at 50,000 uh, by sort of December next year. You know, we'll, we'll, have, we'll have to wait and see, but yeah. Most people are betting on it. That's where the money is going at the moment. They all see Bitcoin being over 50,000, uh, you know, and that's where the smart money's going. Uh, you know, the, the people are betting on it. That's where the most money's going. So, yeah, things are looking optimistic for Bitcoin. We can go over here, and what I really like about this one, it's not just Bitcoin. So, a Crypto OG here says that altcoins will outperform uh, Bitcoin in the near future. Uh, and at the moment, you'd have to agree with that. You know, Bitcoin is traveling all right, you know, but it's really been kind of stuck at that $9,000 to $10,000 range, particularly more around the $9,000 to roughly $9,500. At some stage, there's going to be some kind of move, whether it's up or down, who knows. But a lot of people are thinking it's most likely going to be up. Because of that, it might, it's quite possibly it'll go down a little bit. Uh, I don't see it going too low. I really don't see uh, Bitcoin going below $8,000 anytime soon. But not impossible. But yeah, altcoins are on an absolute tear at the moment. And we'll have a look at that in the future. Uh, sorry, in a moment in the future. Getting tongue-tied there. All right, also, so DeFi, it's on a massive surge. There's 240,000 users and they're they've invested more than two billion dollars that roughly equates to around about eight thousand three hundred thirty three dollars uh, per user now i can tell you right now not every user is putting eight thousand dollars into DeFi. Uh, some are going to be putting a whole lot more in and others are going to be putting a whole lot less in but it's made two billion with only a quarter of a million people investing in DeFi. if we think about finances worldwide that is an absolute drop in the ocean. That is nothing. Wait till it goes mainstream. Two billion, that'll rise to unbelievable dollars. Now, in saying that, I've invested into DeFi projects and I'm really liking them. I do see them having a pullback at some stage. And speaking of pullbacks, we'll go over to CoinGecko and have a look. So this is uh, how the market's been doing in the last few days. You, you can see Veet has been on an absolute rip terror. Uh, got myself some Veet, Dogecoin. Uh, it's on a massive pump and that's all to do with TikTok. <laughs> It'll be interesting to see just how uh, high Dogecoin can go with TikTok, you know. It's up, yeah, 87% in seven days. So I guess we'll have to wait and see, you know, that TikTok's quite viral. Uh, ADA, uh, it's near 60% over seven days. Lend, you know, near 50%. Yeah, there's lots of coins that are doing really, really well. Carbon Networks, uh, Synthetic Networks, REN, Zero uh, X. Again, uh, a lot of the DeFi stuff, Chainlink, which is uh, heavily used by DeFi, they've all been on these massive pumps. Now, as good as that is, I would say yes, be cautious. I absolutely see a retrace uh, happening at some stage. Now, it might, might, might not be tomorrow. It might not even be this week. They could go on a an absolute cracker you know go up another hundred percent in the next seven days but i would more likely lean towards we're going to have a pullback at some stage uh, and it could be up to 50 percent of how much they've uh, gone up maybe even more but again who knows anyway definitely positivity all through the markets but proceed with caution is what i would say to you all right stay safe be kind to one another i'm hoping you all made some gains today i'll see you next time